<clears throat> Welcome back. I am now fed and etc. I guess saying and etc is redundant because it means and other things. Last hammer. This should finish the job. Everyone ready? Oh, are you ready? My body's ready. This is my favorite thing. don't want me to spoil anything, skip like 30 seconds while I say this. But these are my favorite things to do in the game. Um, the one at the end, I don't enjoy that much because its mechanics work a little differently and you don't actually kill it, you mostly just disable consoles and stuff. But um, these, in essence, other than the one at the end there, this is effectively the only thing, the only boss fights that exist in this game. <clears throat> and that's a mix that's a mixed bag. Truly. Oh, there's one right there. Okay. Okay, that just missed entirely. I have no shield, that's not great news. Peekaboo, shoot the head! <laughs> Thank you, PB. Very descriptive. Oh, reload, 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 reload. Wow, normal difficulty really beats up this hell. But yeah, this is the this is the only boss fight. There's four of them throughout the game. And they are they're all identical mechanically. Just different like terrain stuff to play around with. Just keep making more. I can really kill them. Oh, that's ready. Oh, did that thing hit me in the face? When I was watching MK Ice and Fires, let's play of this back in the pre-release days, like a week before it got released, he was he got an early copy, or she, I guess they don't have a voice on the, on their channel. <clears throat> and they were sh trying to shoot at the legs in the one that they faced. And um it was weird because it didn't look like it was actually losing any health, and now I'm wondering if it, if I just suffered the same thing that they did. Is it just it is it did lose health? It just didn't look like that because because maybe they were playing on normal, which I am not. Well, I am now. Time is time. But I wasn't well, always. Like I played casual first, and then my biotic is running on casual, and it kind of gets burned a little more quickly than that. And it could just be a result of the difficulty. But MK Ice and Fire was also doing something weird. Is he was fighting this thing with a freaking shotgun, and I'm like, you got it. He, and he was doing it mid range, so I don't know if he was actually hitting the thing or not. Funny hop you can do. Oh, I need to pay attention to the fight. But <laughs> we're <here> bunny hopping. <laughs> oh hey. Ow, ow, ow. I forgot I had abilities. Did it kill my 
my little remnant VI. Okay, this thing really burns it. That worked. <clears throat> Alright, come on. Oh wait, that's right, it moves. It actually mo it actually lands like right there. So I need to be over there. This is the third time I've fought it. <laughs> I'm getting this game down to a science, people. These are not angled properly. It lands like right here. Here we go, I could probably use this one. Told you. <clears throat> oh, I'm gonna have to be in the open. Which one is, there it is. Oh god, this is not great. Ah! Car. This is much more useful than my sniper rifle. I'm talking shit about this gun like in the last video. We're gonna go backwards. There we go. Where the real cover is. Yeah, if you could last more than three seconds, that'd be great. The legs will bring it down. Oh dear. Yeah. Piece by piece. I think had all kinds of stuff. Wow. Here's a mistake that I made on my biotic character that I've been rolling off screen lately. I forgot that it drops these the things. All four of them do. At least you made it. And I forgot that, that and I completely like it, like I just I interfaced and ran away. I feel yeah, and yes I do feel dumb about it. That's a lot of loot my biotic could have had. Man, I got a lot of Odds. That's, that's good. Okay, now I need to. I need to get that last 6%. You know, I think I get it from going back and talking to them. I think. Or maybe I don't need to. Never mind. That's a different one, I think. So here's what we're gonna do. Alright. Guess fuck me then. There we go, we'll do this. Okay. <clears throat> you can extract minerals by your mining interface. But yeah, that is one of my favorite things to do in this game is hunting those things down. Now typically they only show up after you do the whole outside thing on all the planets. I think Havarl does not have one. Which is understandable. There's no place to put one. <laughs> but um, they're a lot of fun, and they give you a lot of loot and a ton of experience. Am I okay? I'm not going that way. They're all kind of clustered a little bit. Oh, I think another thing that'll get me. You know what? Yeah, that's gonna be more interesting to do than killing a bunch of animals. I'm just gonna go straight for that thing. That looks like cat tech. 
Oh, we'll get the 250 experience from here. Oh, she was making a feel like me. Enemy clusters are level because I don't remember facing one of those, one of these, on my biotic around this area. So it's got to be level a little bit, level a little bit. It's running my words together. It's something I suffer. It's not a speech impediment or anything. It's just my brain works faster than my mouth does, and I do that in real life a lot. That is not any kind of camera shyness or anything. It's just I talk fast. <clears throat> or rather my brain wishes I talk I could talk faster than I actually do. What is this? Alright, that's a cash. Okay, I've had better. Sure. Didn't even have a red item. I think red items are this game's equivalent to like lead or not epics, I would say. There's no real legendaries in this game. Because you craft everything. Now, as of this recording, I just noticed that Origin put up the deluxe package. And this ties into the Looks like we have thing. some scavenger animals on our lost supply Oh, well, I might as well just do it while I'm drawn by it. Whoa. But, um, I just noticed Origin put up the deluxe edition upgrade for 10 bucks. Now, this, this episode's not going to come out for, like, three months, and hopefully Sam, in that time, sure this? my yes, old job know. might have the taken me back by then, or that, where they might not have. It's unlikely the local Otherwise, my, have my family might have gotten They're it for fun. me, but if you want to go ahead and poke my PayPal, help this support this channel, and I will... Like, those kind of things are the kind of things I would buy with my uh, PayPal that I'm linking in my, my nice descriptions. Work. Not just games but upgrades to games and also like better equipment like if I can somehow manage to scrounge up like 50 60 bucks I'll probably invest in a microphone now allegedly I'm hearing from sources that my mic actually sounds fine but it could be better like I could just I could get a better quality one okay see there we go remnant decryption keys those are always useful <clears throat> I read somewhere that using the remnant decryption keys actually deprives you of the, the uh, achievement that you have to do the 20 Sudoku puzzles in a single playthrough. Walking than buried. But, um, so that's an achievement I'll probably never get. <laughs> because in my first playthrough, I think I. Oh, God, I made a mistake. Maybe I didn't. Okay. In my first playthrough, I don't think I used any decryption keys, but I just used a guide to help me do all the puzzles. You're okay, I can. I, there's these paths there. I can go back up towards it. Long way from the flock, little duck. Little duck? Who's this? Someone who's got work for you. Come to my nav point if you think you're up for it. What do you say, little duck? That is not becoming a thing. <laughs> so there's a um, turbine I can disable, and I think that gives me like 2%. And then there's... Bane, we're coming up on the barracks. Stay sharp. Oh, I can just do it now. Okay. No reason to get cocky, though. But yeah, doing this I think gives me 2%. Um, shutting down one of those, I think it's that one. There's a console in there you can disable. I think that gives me a little bit. So that should finish EOS up for me. My 
I might have did this quest like a few hours ago, and I never faced those until so, like, level of them. 20 or something. Not bad. Not bad. I don't know. My memory could that be bad. seriously the worst nickname. Oh yeah, and I forget these things give 2% every time I grab one. So that's why I'm a little I'm deprived of a couple of percentages. But I'll get there, and then I'm going to go do Vold, and I'll record that, but I may... Like at a certain point, I need to stop recording. If you're just joining me, it's due to the fact that I... Oh god, I forgot to do the thing. If you're just joining me for some reason and you're not watching all of my Mass Effect videos, it. The I live in a house first. that has four people, so at around Late. eight or my nine o'clock in the evening, in my household, I basically need to stop talking because that's when people start going to bed. <clears throat> all right, I need to clear all these people. Oh man, there's two of them. All right, this is gonna be fun. Go ahead. Oh, come on. There we go. What the hell is that thing? You know what they are. You face several. Big! Really big! Just... so weird because this area doesn't unlock until after you come back to it after like clearing Marl and Aya and all that. Oh here's the thing. But yeah, now you can see one of one of my graphical weirdness that happens. Like I and some tech is lit up like it's outside. These can't be the only generators that Cat brought. There's my hundred percent presence on ears. I would agree, Pathfinder. We'll just keep shutting them down as we find them. You rock. Any more? Yeah, there's a couple more. Are oh, they the glitched ones? You'll see some of that too. Yeah, he's in the wall. Cool. Had to deal with that for a few times now. Alright, well, you can have fun in the wall. I realize I'm, this video is at 20 minutes. I'll um, have the conversation with Bane, and I'm going to work to my Tempest, and I'll start recording again. I think when I touch down on hold or something. Because I'm, I'm, I'm done here. <laughs> Our friend was calling from a kid bunker. That thing. Know he's a friend. Following us? No. Okay. In my very first playthrough, I only shot at a couple of those kid over there, and then I went ahead and ran in here and that a couple a cat like well, ran well. in here and started yeah, shooting at me mid dialogue. It was kinda of funny. Is this your handiwork? Absolutely. 
Name's Bane Masani. Cat hunting's a hobby of mine. Killing cat isn't a pastime. Really? Because that's all I've done on Eos. Planet's a cat magnet. I've been tracking them down, marking locations to target. You took out the crown jewel, but the bastard yeah, still have a presence here. For this, you this want to protect that shiny new outpost. Is this you game doesn't really tie into the previous three all that much safe. due to how it's framed. Glad to hear it. But sending nav points. You see a lot of um, surnames. Eventually, we'll want to hit the crown jewel, their main base. Like Masani is think clearly related to Zaid from Mass Effect Three, or was he? Was he in two? Yeah, yeah, he was introduced in the in two Mass Effect Two. I think, or was he three? Yeah, he was two because he's not a squad mate in three. Okay, yeah. And then there's um. Huh. I'm ready. It's your funeral. I can't stop. Then you there's freaking. Happy hunting, Pathfinder. Okay. Um, Conrad's sister basically shows up in um Kadara. And then there's Kandros, who's related to the first female Turian you meet in Mass Effect 3's Omega DLC, so there is that. Oh, you know one thing I need? I never took out that base. I need to do that. Investigate Ket Presence. Okay. I'll do that in the next episode, actually, because that's a whole thing. I'll see you soon.